minutes, and it will be for the Elevate Submission Series 170 pound purple belt Noki Championship. First, fighting out of the blue corner, representing finesse, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, this is Eric Sinach. <laughs> Eric Sinash making his way down. The challenger looking to compete in the no-gi purple belt division and take home a title. Folks, championship bouts will get scrappy. They are 10-minute matchups as we get ready for the introduction of the champion. Opponent fighting out of the red corner, representing Gracie Baja West Chase, he is Aldo Pere. And here comes the champion, Aldo Perez. We patiently await. There he comes, the champion looking to defend his crown looking to walk in and walk out as the champion, Aldo Perez. Will Sinesh be a king killer or will the king reclaim his throne? We'll find out right now. 10 minutes on the clock. Right away. Sinesh trying to trying to thread the submissions. And Perez tried to snatch a heel in all of that. Once again, Perez trying to play guard. Folks, I've just been informed. There is an, actually, this is the crowning of a champion. I apologize, I misspoke. My fault, my fault. Either way, someone will leave as a champion here tonight. Perez trying to play his guard. It's nice trying to pressure in. Nice, nice. Perez rotates through, nice. finds a leg. See if he can do something with it. Snitch walking him back to the center. Not wanting to get reset by any referees here. It's a championship matchup. Perez is doing a very good job of weaving those legs. And they're inverted. All tangled up here. Sinatch using his legs to feed through, looking for, for the leg lock. Sinesh standing back up, choosing to disengage with the leg lock game, but you gotta believe Perez wants to get right back there. Sinesh trying to get around that guard. It's a scramble. 
Although Perez wants that leg every time Sinatch steps in, Perez just goes inverted. Perez going inverted. Take your hips out away. Now stand up. Stay on top. Harass his head. Snap him down for our headlock. We know this guy likes to attack our head. Every time he touches our head, that's a connection to us. You have to grip on the hand all the way, all the time to do. Perez trying to go inverted again. Sinesh trying to dance around it. You saw they're using his foot to pin the knee. Just trying to prevent that inversion however he can. Stepping in again. Perez again with the off balance. Yes, engage with the De La Hero. Now start pushing, applying pressure. Wait for him to go for leg locks and pass off of it. Yes. Sinatch looking to step over, find his own leg lock. Needs to be careful. Perez now has the leg of Sinatch deep. He can create something with it. Every time Sinatch goes to get away, Perez just grabs that knee and slides back in, looking to stretch out. Nice. Step over almost into a toe hold. Trying to take the back here, looking to roll through with Sinatch. Perez hanging off for dear life. It's a dangerous footlock game the, these two are playing. Hey, Aldo, let's go again. Nice. Let's go, Aldo. 4.30 on the clock, Aldo. I want some more attacks as well. Let's go. Nice. nice. Although Perez rolls nice. all the way through, trying to find that leg again. Aldo, we still have four minutes. We still have four Eric, minutes. I want you on top. I need you to be more active on top. Let's get on top and start working your passing. Nice. Keep working to the inside nice. position. Eric, you can play on bottom. Eric, you can play on bottom. Stay focused. Let's go. Let's get it all though. Nice. Manage the inside, nice. Now we're dominating. Eric, you want to play bottom, lay down right now. Let's go. And pull into a leg. Let's get into our position. Start to work with your own you have look. Less than four oh, minutes, look. okay? Nice. Keep putting pressure. Match is trying to pressure. apply pressure to the head. I need some submission attacks, Eric. Go to the inside with your other Work with the left leg. Nice. Perez trying to use his legs to create an opening. So Nash back up. Got to believe Perez can weave through, try to go invert it again. Snatch pressuring in, pressuring in, pressuring in. Perez just does an excellent job redirecting that pressure. Look at this. Snatch might have the knee bar here. Trying to pull. Can he get it? Perez saying no, no, no. He doesn't have it. That knee might not be up on the hip. And now the heel hook. And now Perez looking for the toe hold here. Can he get it? Scramble, scramble, scramble. Who's going to come out on top? That was close. That was close. 245 left, folks. And this has been back and forth. Sinatch now trying to put some pressure down on that leg and prevent more. Now Perez will try to play from the top. Sinatch will give his guard a go. Perez looked like he was tired there, maybe baiting him in. Perez trying to pressure in. Outside pass, you get your head to the hip once you get the angle. And Snatch looking to go inverted. This is your game. Eric, this is your game. Focus, focus. Let's focus. go. Two minutes, two minutes. Let's go. Let's, Let's go. get the guard back. Yes. Let's go. And Perez looking to drop back into a heel hook. Sir. Nice. 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 
Perez picks up the win. The new Purple Belt champion in the no-gi division. Let's throw it over to Bryce Boudreaux. He will receive a medal. He will receive the championship honors. Fantastic matchup by both men, but it is Aldo Perez that picks up the victory. Our official calling a stoppage to the action at one minute and 47 seconds. Declaring your winner via heel hook. And new Elevate Sub Series 170 pound purple belt Noki champion Aldo Perez. Aldo Perez from the get go was looking for the legs, looking for the heel hooks, looking for the ankle locks, anything he can get his hands on, and it is that game plan that picks him up the victory and the title of Purple Belt King at the 175 pound no gi class. Fantastic showing from Eric Sinesh, but congratulations to Aldo Perez, the new king of the Purple Belts.